Hi everyone! In this tutorial, we will focus on the solution reference for closing ceremony of sports. This solution includes a basic car and the mission tool building reference. This solution is for reference only. We strongly encourage users to build and innovate on their own using the power of imagination. This tutorial is for those who want to save time and improve efficiency. The first part is about the construction of a car body base. Here is the top view and bottom view of the car. Firstly, we need to install the wheels and motor on the chassis. Let me show you the building progress. Next step is the grayscale sensor and universal wheel installation. Here is the building progress. After that, we should install the controller on the top of the vehicle. After that step, the basic car construction is complete. Next, we connect the controller to the motor. Note that the direction of the universal wheel is frontal and the driving wheel is opposite. The left motor is connected to controller port A and the right motor is connected to controller port B. The gray scale sensor is connected to ports 1 through 5 from left to right. Here is the connection progress. Afterwards, we need to build the mission motor and mount the one pin gear 30 axle on the motor. This is how we can do it. triple pin installation with shortened on the inside. Add a frame to the motor with a beam and coupler to make it easier to add parts in subsequent steps. 
Here is the connection progress. Note that in this task, motor is connected to the controller port C, and the mechanical structure of the competition task can be built on this basis. This solution is for reference only. Players can design and change the structure according to the specific competition tasks and their vision. In the next part is the reference for the remaining setup and connection steps. Now, I will show you the reference construction solutions for the closing ceremony of sports tasks. The first task is the firework display. The firework display is mainly achieved by making the handle on the firework rotate, either clockwise or counterclockwise. We can add a U-shaped beam to the front of our car in the vertical position to the ground so it can rotate the lever. Here is the building progress. Next, is the construction for the delegation entry task. We can either push or pull the delegation to the target area. The reference model that we provide is this. With the combination of the beam and the 80 axle, build a structure that is just enough to get the model stuck and then complete the task by moving the vehicle forward. Here is the building progress. Moving to the third task, the artistic performance. This step is similar to the fireworks display task. Turn the lever 90 degrees counterclockwise to attract the two magnets, and then turn it clockwise back to its original position. In order to save the subsequent programming steps, we can install the U-shaped beam in a different position. Here is the building progress. The next task is the closing speech. We need to move the blue pull rod to make the white 30 beam fall out of the white plate. To our model, we add a 50 axle, push it through the holes in the structure as the vehicle moves forward, and then turn the vehicle to complete the task. In order to save more time to complete the next task, we can add a step to fetch the flag after completing this task. Here is the building progress.
The next task is the flag handover. After vehicle returns to the base, we add a new structure in order to carry the flag and complete the task. This structure can be completed by combining the beam and the axle, and then inserting the axle into the hole of the flag beam. Then we can use the vehicle to bring the flag to the mission point. Here is the building progress. The next task is the medal presentation. There are two steps in this task. The first is to give the athlete a gold medal, and the second is to make the athlete stand. We can push the athlete up to give him a gold medal and then raise the athlete to stand. We can put together a hollow rectangular structure to achieve these two actions. Here is the building progress. Next task is the torch dousing. The task is to first move the torch lever and let the flame fall and then restore the torch lever to close the structure. To achieve this, we can also use axle and beam as before, which are installed in front of the vehicle and are powered by the vehicle turning or the motor above. The second part of this task is to pull the lever down. So the basic solution that we provide is to assemble a robotic arm structure with a beam and then lift it up and drop it down. The second task is to make a matching structure with the axle and beam. Insert the axle into the beam when falling and pull the lever out through the vehicle to complete the two tasks. Here is the building progress. The last task is the 8-minute showcase. For this task, we will move the white beam. Then the iron ball will fall and the actor's figures will spin around. To complete this part, we just need to use a 1264 by 6 degree beam mounted on the upper motor and rotate it to knock out the mechanism. Then for the second part of this task, a color sensor and LED lights need to be installed. Note that the color sensor is connected to the port 10 of the controller. And the RGB lights is connected to the port 9 of the controller. Here is the building progress.
Note, this construction solution is for reference only. You can modify the structure, add or replace parts according to your vision and imagination. That's all for this tutorial. Thank you and bye-bye.